botnets can be used to launch DDoS attacks on other targets, which can cause significant disruption on the internet and affect different online services. Hey everyone, welcome back. And in today's video, we're gonna be talking about smart homes and how you can protect them from the widespread threat of malware. Now, the increase in popularity of smart devices has actually changed the way we live, bringing convenience and connectivity to our homes. From smart thermostats and lighting to security cameras and voice activated assistance, these devices have made our lives more efficient and quite frankly, more enjoyable. With that being said, the increasing adoption of smart homes has also opened the door to new security threats, with malware being a significant risk. And so in this video, we're gonna be talking about the rise of smart homes and some of the malware threats that target them. We're also gonna be discussing some of the steps you need to take to secure your smart home other than the obvious one of using a reliable antivirus on your devices and servers. Speaking of which, if you don't already have an antivirus or are looking for some suggestions, I'll leave some in-depth reviews on antiviruses that I personally recommend along with some discounts in the description down below. So make sure to check those out. Okay, so as I mentioned earlier, smart homes are becoming increasingly popular and the market for smart devices is expanding at a rapid pace. These devices are designed to provide homeowners with more control convenience and energy efficiency. However, this interconnected ecosystem creates a unique vulnerability to cyber attacks, mainly malware. Malware, short for malicious software, is software specifically designed to harm, disrupt, or gain unauthorized access to a computer system or network. When malware infects a smart home, it can compromise privacy, security, and even safety, since everything is linked to either a computer or a server over an interconnected local network. But what exactly are these malware threats? For starters, you have privacy breaches. Smart devices often collect personal data, such as user preferences and daily routines, to better improve their functionality. Malware can exploit these data gathering capabilities, leading to significant privacy breaches. This unauthorized access to personal information can result in identity theft, blackmail, or the misuse of sensitive data. Another threat would be that malware can compromise the security of smart home systems, potentially giving attackers unauthorized access to devices and networks. Hackers may gain control over connected appliances, cameras, and even locking mechanisms, which is pretty dangerous when it comes to physical security as well. Next, we have botnets. Malware-infected devices can be used to create botnets, which are networks of compromised devices controlled by a malicious actor. These botnets can be used to launch DDoS attacks on other targets, which can cause significant disruption on the internet and affect different online services. Other than that, we have data theft. Smart home devices may store sensitive information, such as Wi-Fi, passwords, camera footage, and voice recording. Using malware that infects your systems, cyber criminals can hijack this sort of data and either expose it publicly or use it to extort you for money or to get you to become an accomplice in some of their illegal activities. Lastly, we have device tempering. Malware can manipulate the functionality of smart devices, causing them to behave unexpectedly. For example, an attacker might temper with the settings of a smart thermostat, potentially causing discomfort or damage to the home. Now, before we get into some of the measures that you may take to secure your smart home, Let's take a quick break to talk about today's sponsor, Surfshark One. Surfshark One is a bundle that includes almost all of your cybersecurity needs, from a reputable antivirus to even an ad blocker. While there isn't one tool that can completely guarantee your privacy, having all of them together in one neat package can greatly enhance your cybersecurity. And that's why Surfshark is offering five products in one package. So why pay for them individually when you could get them in one simple, neatly packaged bouquet? This package includes the award-winning Surfshark VPN, which allows unlimited devices, data speed, and protection. The Surfshark antivirus that secures everything on your devices from your webcam to your files. The Surfshark private search engine, which allows you to browse ad-free without any digital footprint. Instant data leak notifications with Surfshark alert and Surfshark Alternative ID, which can generate a whole new online identity and proxy email for you. 
The best part about this is that this bundle comes with a 30-day money-back guarantee, and all these apps work on all major platforms like Windows, macOS, and Android. So if you'd like to check them out, I'll be leaving the bundle link at the top of the description down below. Big thanks to Surfshark for being today's sponsor, and let's get back to the video. Alright, so now that you know some of the devastating effects malware has when it comes to smart homes, what are some of the measures that you can take to secure these sorts of devices and mitigate the effects of malware? For starters, you need to change the default passwords. One of the most common vulnerabilities in smart devices is the use of default passwords. Always change the default login credentials for your devices to strong, unique passwords. Use a combination of letters, numbers, and special characters to make it harder for attackers to guess. Next, try to enable 2FA on your smart devices whenever possible. This adds an extra layer of security by requiring a second form of verification, such as a text message or a fingerprint scan, in addition to your password. Another measure you can take is to regularly update your firmware. Manufacturers release firmware updates to address security vulnerabilities. Make sure that you keep your smart devices up to date with the latest software and security patches. Also, try to enable automatic updates if you have that option. Now, you're going to need to secure your Wi-Fi network. Your home network is the gateway for your smart devices. Protect it with a strong, unique password and use WPA3 encryption. Consider isolating your IoT devices on a separate network from your critical systems to minimize the potential damages from an attack. Other than that, try to use a VPN for remote access. If you need to access your smart home devices remotely, use a virtual private network. A VPN encrypts your connection, making it much more difficult for attackers to intercept your data. And finally, always review app permissions. Be selective when granting permissions to smart device apps. Only provide necessary permissions and regularly review the permissions granted to existing apps. Don't forget to disable any permissions that are not needed. And that's basically it for today's video on securing your smart homes from malware threats. Don't forget that installing a reliable antivirus on your system is the first and most important step to protecting yourself from malware and other similar cyber threats. So if you don't already have one or are looking for some suggestions, make sure to click the link in the description below for some in-depth reviews on antiviruses that I personally recommend along with some discounts. Also, if you like the content or found it useful, make sure to like the video and subscribe to see more of it. And if you have any questions or suggestions, don't hesitate to leave them in the comments as I love to interact with you guys. And that will be all for today, and I'll see you in the next one. Have a great day.